The function to find the volume of a sphere is this. Find the volume of a sphere with a radius of 3. Now this is great because we're going to leave the answer in terms of pi, which means we don't need any decimals in this unless, uh, well, I guess unless you really wanted it. But we don't have to worry about multiplying anything by pi is really what I'm saying. So my volume of this sphere is going to be 4 times pi. My radius is 3, which I will cube, and I'll divide this by 3. So 3 cubed, so I got 4 pi, 3 cubed is 27. And then I would divide this by 3. Now I can use the commutative property to switch these over and multiply the 4 by 27. I'm not going to show that because I'm running out of space. What do I get? 108 over 3. And this would be multiplied by pi right here. And then uh, 108 divided by 3, 36, 36 pi. So this is what it's talking about when it says leave your answer in terms of pi. And if there were units on this, you would say meters or yards cubed specifically for volume. But this will do for now.